Transform's been a great opportunity to uh, make new friends, to understand new cultures, and to come together and learn and think and pray about what it means to be uh, leaders in our different contexts. A leader always has to learn and to grow. So uh, it is very good we have teachers and leaders who are ready to show us how to do this. To lead uh, in a way that's crossing borders, which I think is, is something that EBF is about. Being part of the Transform program gave me the opportunity to uh, meet amazing leaders and uh, lifetime friends. Are very gifted young people. We had 11 of them from 11 different countries. They went through training connected with leadership skills, team building, issuing, working throughout some very difficult issues connected with uh, intercultural work and mission work. Our globalized world requires leaders who understand the nuance of culture and context. And one of the best ways of doing this is to bring leaders from around the region together, to study together, pray together, to learn together, and to hear the Holy Spirit in the work of one another's lives. It's what changed my life as I engaged in one of these programs with the Baptist World Alliance. And I commend an ongoing commitment to drawing these leaders together to learn, to study, to prepare. It's been fantastic to see some national unions replicating the program, doing something similar to what we did here at the Transform on their national level with, um, with, their, with their local um, younger leaders in their unions and within their countries. So it's being, it's being seen as a, as a very good program which should actually be implemented even at, at the union level. So I'm very proud of it. It says something important about investing in, in younger leaders um, as for the whole of the EBF family and I think I hope that this will be something we go on to do more and more in the future, to intentionally set aside time and resources to help uh, leaders grow and develop into the calling that God has placed on their lives. To have an open mindset uh, and at the same time to keep the Bible the centre of our decisions. Transform's also been um, something that's given me a lot of hope for the future, to meet uh, this generation of wise and creative and energetic and passionate uh, disciples of Jesus and leaders um, leaves me hopeful for the EBF's future. I think we will be in very good hands.